Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel from the longest break I ever had, probably, on this channel. So it's been more or less a month, and probably I I have to say Happy New Year in the first place, obviously, even though it's like 15th of January. And just a bit of explanation why I didn't post any videos during the holidays, during the second uh, half of December and first half of January. So here is the short explanation. I made actually two videos. Uh, during December and this was just before the holidays but I found myself making very negative ones you know uh, full of um, I don't know hate maybe not hate but I wasn't very happy about the community about everyone's pessimism about how we treat each other on Twitter for example and I wanted to make a very strong statement I wanted to send out a very strong message which I recorded and then I realized that that is the the smallest part of the community that is just a couple of people and i really shouldn't end the 2022 year with a video where i tell everyone to f off uh, therefore i decided not to post any of those videos and just take a break you know and uh, deconnect from everything which i did of course um, i was expecting myself to come back with full of energy full of optimism which i have obviously i am full of uh, of optimism but the energy stuff is still uh, yeah not great because i don't know lately in the last three four months every month for five days i am i'm drinking these uh anti-flu teas i'm just sick of taking medicines to be honest but uh, yeah i don't know what is happening with my immune system however however we do have great news uh, we have a green market and we will dive into all of those but first i want to start with x portal so as you can see here on xportal.com you can already sign up for the for the new release of the software obviously which you which everyone will be able to uh, download once it's released in 44 days and of course you can sign up for the card for the x card which will be associated with the application and you can use it for anything you want you can top up your app from the card and you can spend your crypto or stablecoin or whatever you have uh, with the card now if you want to do it the registration is very uh, straightforward it's very simple you just need to input your email and your phone number and after that you will need to install the exporter and activate your account after February 28th, uh, 2023, after which you will have the opportunity to win some e-gold and uh, swag bag. And uh, this is, I guess, the same thing as it was on the X, uh, X day. Obviously, the, the winners will be those who gain the most uh, tickets, which is from referees, obviously, from, uh, from friends, inviting friends. So if you didn't do it yet and you don't have a close friend or a family member, you know, uh, whom you like more, uh, who also wants to win this championship, then I would be very grateful if you used this uh, this referral, which is in the description. It is my referral, and if I win, obviously I will uh, I will organize a giveaway and give some e gold out for the people. So yeah, let's see. If you didn't do it, use the link. It's in the description. Let's go forward and check the market because. Bitcoin just pumped. Now, the pump, as probably you know, it was because the CPI from the Fed came back uh, very positively. It seems that the inflation is dropping and everyone now expects that they will not um, hike the rates even more. The problem is that they also said that if they see a rallying market, then they will obviously uh, tighten the bet even more because the 2% is still far away. And uh, yeah, since everything pumped, everything went up, and we can also see the indexes, for example, and that is that is what they are watching. They don't watch Bitcoin, actually. Uh, they watch the indexes and the UK's index, for example, it's an all time high. But let's go back to S&P 500. Obviously, Bitcoin, everyone is familiar with. They said that they will be comfortable to tighten the bell even more. And uh, that would mean that we will go uh, a bit lower or we just return to the bottom. This might have been the bottom because in this couple of days, maybe two weeks, we just erased all the dump from the FTX crash, uh, and that is pretty good. That is pretty good. It, this signals, this signals that the fifteen thousand five hundred might be the bottom. So, yeah, I'm quite happy with that. In any case, if it starts to go down and reaches the eighteen thousand something, I will buy more. Right now, we have this 
resistance obviously which you can see it stopped the price it is also the 100 a day simple moving average but we do have a resistance now a pretty strong one because it was touched quite a few times so that is good that is good let's be happy about this let's enjoy the moment because that is what's the most important let's check e-gold e-gold as you can see right now uh is at 39.3 it's at 40 dollars i was expecting it to grow a bit more uh however i didn't see any big altcoins and now e-gold is considered kind of in the bigger zone with the big community i didn't see any big altcoins grow a lot I know that Solana went from $7 to 20, 23, 24, which is very nice. But Solana also had a huge crash uh, just before that. So people just saw an opportunity to pump and dump. I don't know what will happen with Solana. It seems that a lot of developers uh, left the chain. I don't know if they get new projects. So if anyone has any info about that, please leave it in the comments. I want to start and yeah, research a bit about Solana because if the community is not leaving and if a new project will still come on Solana then Solana might be a good investment however breaking down every every month uh, maybe not the best I don't know we will see about that also let's not forget that the next uh, X launchpad Maya launchpad former Maya launchpad project is coming it is not announced yet if you go to xlaunchpad.com you will see that it's still Ash Swap but we know that it is Hatem and uh, it was announced on X day. Now on the plane, uh, when I was flying back to Dubai, I rewatched the keynote uh, of uh, Hatem, of Hatem's uh, CEO, maybe I don't remember his name. And uh, I think it's very really interesting. It is very important for the Iron ecosystem. And I will make a video about how Hatem just adds the last puzzle, which is needed in the Multiverse X ecosystem, which all the other ecosystem have, but we don't have yet. Let's close this with a big question mark because I, I just don't understand what is happening. It is probably the unlocking, but uh, yeah, Max took another hit. However, this hit, the volume was almost as big as the previous one. However, the fall wasn't. And that is obviously good news. I'm watching the daily. Max is still downtrending and it will downtrend for a long time until all the unlocks happen, until people the angry people uh, sell all the tokens and um, until this 2.0 really kicks in. Now, the fact that we changed or swapped all of our max into max 2.0 and with the energy, with everything, with metabonding, this will probably be relevant or felt when, I don't know, in one year maybe. So we need all the tokens to be unlocked. We need the angry people to leave the space. And after that, maybe Max will have other utilities. Maybe it will be listed on other centralized exchanges. And that is what I expect Max to start growing. If you believe in it, great buying opportunity. I bought some Max, but only to enter the competition. I wouldn't buy right now. I, I, I don't like uh, to buy Max. I didn't buy Max. I didn't convert any e-gold into Max. I am mostly with the amount of max which I had back then uh, when I just taked my, my e-gold. It was 2021, 20, maybe June, something like that. For me, it seemed always too good to be true. A max to go to $1 and many people become billionaires and millionaires only from max. That just I, I just didn't think that will happen. So yeah, we will see what is going to happen. However, it might be a good idea to buy some just before the bull run or after a bigger dip because since it's a small coin the volatility can also be very big and as you can see right now the dips are not that big you know yes we are dipping and probably we will have more let's hope that the upside will be just as good thank you for watching hope you enjoyed this video if you did hit the subscribe button obviously I'm just shaking back in into making videos, but I will try to do them regularly from now on because we do have a lot of things to cover and a lot of other things which are coming up on the Multiverse X ecosystem, which we need to discuss about. I'm talking about the new features like X Fabric, and we need to uh, discuss whether they are good or bad, useful or not, so on, so on. So thank you very much and uh, see you in the next one.